Morning, gentlemen. Morning, boss. So, uh, what's going on? It's evaluation day. It's the day when I monitor your boot camp class and review your performance in the workplace. I never heard of it. I know. I just made it up. Recently, I've noticed a decline in the number of boot campers we have at the gym. At first, so I thought the clients were just being lazy. Uh, then I realised the problem's not with the clients. It's with the trainer. So what, you're just going to stand there and watch me during my class? Sounds about right. Yeah, it's not fair. What about him? Get lost. Always do an exceptional job. <laughs> oh, so I speak to my relatives from time to time while I'm at work. It's not just the phone calls. Need I mention your mother's meetings? So last weekend, my husband was away for the whole week and I had the whole house to myself. So I soaked in a nice hot bubble bath and had a glass of red. Oh, well, sometimes it's good to just unwind. <laughs> it's not all I'd be indulging in if my husband was away. <laughs> just so bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, girls. What's up? Some cannoli. <laughs> cannoli. You don't see a problem with that? This is a gym. You can't be serving sweets in here. Bro, you're the boot camp instructor. Your job's to get them to lose the weight, not gain it. Well, excuse me for rewarding my clients for their hard work. Wait, so, let me get this straight. Your idea of a reward is to get them to undo all the exercise they just did. <laughs> Don't be stupid. They eat the cannoli before we work out. You're under review. End of discussion. Put your game face on, princess. You're next. <laughs> Little boy. <laughs> My first month of training has tested me. Uh, Aaron's had me squatting twice a week. So my legs have been like jelly. On the plus side, look at these trunks. <laughs> I really hope he takes it easy on me this week. I can't fall down those stairs again. I can't believe this, where are they? I guess no review today. <laughs> Matty boy! Uh, yeah? Mm. Okay, Kate, when you're ready, straight into your bridges. Okay. <sighs> you okay? Yeah, I'm just feeling a little bit sore. What's up? Oh, I think it's my hamstring. Okay. Can you help me stretch it a little bit? Yeah, sure. Thanks. Play back. Okay. Why'd you do this? Why do you two are all out? What? You're, you're having sex in the gym! No! No! Uh, no! Is wait. this what this is? Because I'm totally cool with it. Welcome everybody, thank you, thank you all for coming. It's so good to see you all. <laughs> when you run a boot camp for so long, you, you eventually learn a few things, don't you? Hmm. First is to always take it slow. You don't want to waste your client's energy straight away. And second, they yeah. are... There's only one. Okay, so today we're going to uh, start with some uh, jogging on the spot, you know? Uh, okay, and let's go. Yes, picking up the base, picking up the base. Come on, lift those knees, lift those knees. And now we go to jumping jacks, let's go. Come on. Good. Luca. Guess what? This is a boot camp. This is more like. Oh, can I, uh... No, you cannot substitute the cannoli for cupcakes. Um, guys, can I stop now? You should be running drills, getting them to do 
burpees. Make them work, man. Well, maybe I would if I didn't have the pressure of you looking over my shoulder every move I make. No, seriously, my legs are deteriorating. Your inability to run this camp is exactly the reason I have to babysit you. I have my own way of getting things done. Why do I all constantly have to follow your rule book? I'm your boss, that's why. You know what, I'm sick of you. Always putting me down. You know, you know what? I quit. <sighs> you can stop now. Oh. Oh, thank you. Burpees. I don't understand. Well, you see, I was in here earlier setting up for my afternoon appointments and I witnessed something so foul and inappropriate. What is she talking about? She thinks she saw Kate and I having sex. And you were actually... Stretching. Oh. Stretching! I was stretching her out. <laughs> Not like that. Okay, so why do you need me? I wish to file a complaint. Sexual conduct in the workplace cannot be tolerated. Back home, we have ways of dealing with this kind of behavior. We have guns. Okay. Well, complaints need to go through Aaron. Yeah, well, Aaron's busy with Lucas boot camp this week, and so naturally all the responsibility gets handed down to you as the next available impartial party. Congratulations. Thank you. Sex is an act that should be shared between two people who love each other and not brought into a professional environment. Standards must be maintained. Oh, we had our clothes on, for God's sake. I know what I saw. Do you even know what sex is? Of course I do. It's touching and rubbing and... So, kind of like massage. It is nothing like massage therapy. Really? People come in, they take their clothes off, you rub them all over their body. Kind of sounds like your definition of sex to me. And, to top it all off, you get paid to do it. Boom, bitch! Oh my lord. I'm a prostitute. That was easy. We gonna talk about what just happened in there? I just... I just wish you guys would treat me with more respect, you know? Like, I'm good at what I do. I know you're good at what you do. Why do you think I hired you in the first place? You know I'm only messing with you most of the time. And if I'm ever hard on you, it's just because I want to help you improve and help you get better. The clients aren't the only ones here to grow. Yeah, I guess so. See you guys later. Hey, why don't you come out with us? Oh, I, I, I don't want to intrude. Oh, don't be stupid. You did me a huge favor in there taking that boot camp class. Come out. We want to get to know you better. Yeah, alright. <laughs> we'll take you down the road to this new Mexican place, man. They do the best burritos you've ever had. I mean, we could go do that or we could just have some coffee.